Hello guys, welcome back to Coding Cafe. My name is Mohamed Ali and till now as you know that we have successfully completed the group chat. Now a user can create group and inside that group a user can talk to different people from around the world. And in the previous tutorial as you know that we have also completed the settings activity. Now a user can set his profile picture and his profile status just like you guys see in WhatsApp. So now in this video tutorial we will work on the find friends functionality so that a user can search for uh, new people and then the user can send request to them or other people can send a request to an online user so that uh, they can accept their uh, request that is for the contact and then they will be able to uh, chat with each other and so on okay so let's do that. So now uh, first of all uh, let's create another activity click here new activity and an empty activity and that empty activity name will be find friends. So basically uh, now in this video we will uh, design this find friend activity but in the next tutorial we will display all the users that are using this app we will display all the users there and then we will add a search functionality to that so that a user can search for people uh, on the find friends activity and then a user can send a request for the contact to that user so it is created successfully a find friend activity and now first of all uh, go to the activity find friend dot xml now here click on text and make sure to change this constant layout to the relative layout first and now the next thing is here we need to add a toolbar so we can say include close this and now here layout which is by the name app bar layout and we created this layout in the previous video tutorial okay I hope you remember that which is our this app bar layout custom app bar layout basically let's give it some ID and the ID will be find friends toolbar and after that we need to add a recycler view okay so we will be using a recycler view to display the uh, all the users okay so for that here we can simply write recycler view so this will be uh, for first let me complete this then you will uh, I will explain everything when in the next video when we will be retrieving all the users from the Firebase database so this is our recycler view now go to the text and what we're gonna do all we're gonna need is to uh, give it ID so the ID for this one will be let's call this as find, find underscore friend underscore recycler list and it should be below this uh, app bar layout okay so in order to move it below from that we can simply write here below and you can see this layout below ID and copy the app bar layout ID and paste that here oh sorry this is the app bar layout I mean this is the layout okay the ID for this uh, uh, toolbar is this one which is find friend toolbar copy that and paste that find friends toolbar ID here so yeah that's it and now let's define and initialize that fields here on our uh, find friends activity so here we can say private toolbar and this is the toolbar let's let's call this as m toolbar the second one is the recycler view so we can say recycler view let's call this as recycler list and now here in our own create method so for the recycler view we can say find friend recycler list equals recycler view find view by idr dot id dot find friend recycler list and then find friend dot set layout manager new linear layout manager 
context will be this which is our uh, find friend activity dot java file the next thing is the toolbar so here we can say m toolbar equals to toolbar find view by idr dot id find friends toolbar set support action bar and toolbar get support action bar so we are going to uh, add a title to that and also a back button on this toolbar dot set display home as of enabled to true get support action bar dot set display show home enabled to true for the title we can say get support action bar dot set title and the title will be find friends and now for the back button we have had these two lines now how we can uh, send the user now we have to uh, specify that is to which uh, activity we want the user to uh, go back when a user click on the back button on the toolbar so for that all you're gonna need is to go to the manifest file here it is Android manifest and here you can see we have over this find friends activity so here you can simply write parent parent activity name you can see this okay and the parent activity name will be main activity so when a user click on the uh, back button on the toolbar it should send the user to the main activity so yeah that's it and, uh, this is our find friends activity and we have to set an intent when a user click here on the find friend options okay which is this one so this is on our main activity so let's go to the main activity first and if we scroll here here you can see on option item selected item selected here we have this uh, find friend option okay so what we're gonna do here we can simply create another method uh, which will send the user from the main activity to the find friends activity so change this send user to find friends activity first of all make sure to change this login activity to the find friends activity and remove this line okay and change this login intent to find friend and yeah that's it and now let's come here here we can simply call that method which is send user to find friend activity so now we can test the app so you can see that the app is running now successfully and now let's go to the find friends so click on find friends and here we go you can see that this is the uh, title and this is the back button so if I click on this back button then it send me to the main activity so yeah that's it for this video and in the next video tutorial we will create a layout and then we by using the uh, new or you can say the latest version of firebase recycler adapter we will display all the users here on our find friends activity so yeah that's it for this video and if anyone is new to our channel then please subscribe our channel calling cafe thumbs up for this video and see you guys in the next video bye for now